Hey, what's up guys? This is David8719 back with y'all again. And this time I'm bringing y'all something different. Something that I got in the mail about a week and a half ago. And uh, this is what it is. This is a something from Vetter. And it's a holster. And this is a holster for a P30SK. And uh, check this out. This is how it came in the mail. Um, it comes in this little pouch right here. Which I think this is pretty cool. Very solid. Um, and it came in this envelope right here, which I also think is very cool. It's got the American flag on it. And as you can tell, I'm a big fan of that as well. Um, but let me show you the holster. Here it is. Now, like I said, this is a holster for a P30SK, which is an HK firearm. And, uh, the first thing you're going to notice here, it's the, uh, the pattern of the holster. This is what you guys call a basket weave pattern and uh, it's an option on their website uh, they have they have all different types of, of options for patterns colors and they have a whole list of uh, firearms that they make holsters for um, including a, a big list for a the HK uh, firearms as well which is one of the reasons why I went with them this time um, Here's a different look in the back of it. Um, now I will say this, after wearing a toaster holster for a full size BP9 for about four years, I have noticed some differences. Uh, this is my first experience with one of their uh, Vetter holsters. Um, and so far it has been a very solid holster. I've been wearing this for about a week and a half, like I said, uh, it's very solid, strong, and like I said, the pattern is just beautiful. I think it's uh, elegant, classy, and uh, it just gives a different look to the firearm as well, which I will show you in a minute. Um, but like, like I said, uh, there's a few differences that I have noticed. For example, this clip. Um, now, as you can see, this clip right here, uh, it has two screws in it. And you know, and that's done because you can loosen up this screw right here and adjust the cant to your firearm to either like this, like that, or straightforward like this, which I think that's a very cool concept. Um, and I understand the concept of the metal clip, uh, but I have to say it took me a little while to get used to it. And, uh, and that's because if I can give you a, a quick example here, this is the toaster holster for the BP9 full size. And uh, if you can see here, this is a polymer clip style clip right here. And you can see lengthwise, it's different. Now, let's say I put on my you know, my belt after I fasten it and everything and I use my full size BP9, I normally wear this at three or four o'clock position, which if I fasten up my belt before I put on my gun, I can stick this inside the waistband and adjust my holster around to the three or four position without having to loosen up my belt with no problem. You know, but with a better holster it's a little bit more difficult because this is the metal clip and it has the link right here so I cannot put this inside my waistband with my belt already fastened I have to loosen up my belt place this in place to where the three or four position where I, I wear my gun and I have to leave it in place now once in once in place it's very comfortable to wear you know um, very comfortable to wear. I do have to say that. Um, and I normally don't have a problem with toaster uh, with toaster holsters. This has been a great company and great holsters. I've been using it for four years and they have holding up very well. But the only reason why I went with better holsters as an option is because I wanted a different look. I wanted a different pattern. 
And like I said, they offer different patterns, different colors, different uh, holsters for different firearms options. You know, especially the HK firearm, you know, firearm line, uh, which I'm a big fan of. Um, now, like I said, I just wanted a different look. Um, a different style of holster. And like I said, I really enjoyed this basket weave pattern. I think it's 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 very nice, very well uh, made, solid, strong, and um, you know I have enjoyed using this holster. Um, like I, this is my first time experiencing a holster from Vetters, but I have used their uh, Cobra weave, uh, their Cobra, you know, gun belt. Um, And like I said, you know, Toaster Holsters is a great company, you know, and I believe that this is uh, their, uh, you know, I forgot the name of the pattern of this, of, of this holster. Uh, you know, this is one, a color option that they had. I don't believe they offered this anymore. I honestly forgot the name of the pattern. Uh, I think it's cryptid, some, you know, cryptid, white cryptid. Uh, typhoon color or something uh, if I can remember uh, I don't I don't believe they offer this pattern anymore but like I said I've been wearing this for four years and I just normally got tired of looking at the white I wanted something different now I'm a you know I don't believe in having a lot of different holsters for one gun um, that's why I've been wearing that holster for the BP9 for about four years um, but this holster right here from Vetters is a holster for a P30SK. And like I said, I just wanted something different. You know, and I've always been a big fan of this basket weave uh, pattern. Uh, and another option that you know, why I chose Vetters is because they have an option to have uh, left-handed side holsters, which I'm also a left-handed shooter. So they have that option as well. Now, Toaster does too, but they are very limited to the, you know, uh, pattern and colors that they, you know, um, that they have on their website from you to choose from. And, you know, they don't offer a lot of holsters, you know, for a lot of different uh, HK firearms. And um, Better does. Better has a whole list of HK firearms that they make holsters for. And they have different colors, different patterns. So that's why I went with uh, better holsters this time. Uh, and I have to say, besides this clip that it took me a little while to get used to, um, I have no complaints. This has uh, been a very good holster, very comfortable. Um, you know, I will continue to use better. Um, you know, from time to time, and like I said, I'm a big fan of their Cobra uh, gun belts. I will. Um, now, this is I'm gonna show you what else came with this holster. Now, this is the holster. Now, this is like I said, the, the the pouch, the, the little pouch that it came with. Now, this right here, this is uh, different uh, clips for your belt in case you wear a different belt, different width of belt. Um, now this is optional. You don't have to do that. You don't have to, uh, you know, choose this option to have different clips, you know. But the only reason why I chose to add the option to have different uh, size clips, it's because I have been wearing a new belt that I'm going to do a review on here in a few weeks after I get done testing it out. Um... And this right here, this is the, you know, the, the clip that came on the holster. I've been wearing it as it came. I haven't had a problem with this size clip. So I haven't had the option to, uh, you know, to change these out. But I just ordered these just to have them just in case I did have a, you know, a problem with the new belt that I've been wearing and testing out. Now, as you can see. This is a, um, you know, a length that's shorter for, for this clip right here. 
and um, this clips are a little longer. Now, if you switch them out, I believe that the holster will sit lower, you know, inside your waistband because of the length of this, um, of either one of these clips right here. Uh, but like I said, I haven't had a problem with this clip. So for me, I have not um, had to change this out. But if I choose to, you know, or end up having a problem with it eventually, I can switch them out, you know, without having to call and order and, and wait and all that. I already have the clips as an option. But the option to have those extra clips is optional. You don't have to do that. Um, I just decided to do it just to be on the safe side since I've been wearing a new belt um, lately. And the belt that I have been wearing, it's a leather belt. So that's why I decided to um, be on the safe side and order the clips. Um, and this is a solid clip. This is very solid. Once you, you know, get it to the position where you normally like to wear the holster. Because you can wear it with the cant or without the cant. Depends on you. And this is a very solid clip. You know, very strong, very solid. Um... But like I said, the only problem that I have found is that, you know, you do have to adjust this holster and the gun, you know, to the position where you normally wear it. Now, for me, it's a three or four o'clock position. So I have to place my gun and holster in that position before I fasten up my belt because I cannot move it back and forth, you know, with my belt fastened. And that's because of this length right here. And this clip, the way that the, the clip is designed. But once you get it in place, fasten up your belt. It is very comfortable, very, you know, very easy to wear. You know, and I haven't had a problem with it over a week and a half. Now, like I mentioned before, um, you know, they do offer, you know, holsters for left hand left hand shooters, which I, that's a big plus for me. Now, Toaster does offer the same option. But like I said, they don't offer, you know, different, a lot of uh, different style, you know, pattern holsters. You know, they um, are very limited with the patterns that they, ch that they offer. And their, you know, their gun list is very limited. Um, but Toaster is a great, you know, great holster. You know, I have no problem with them. Um, you know... The holster has hold up well after four years, and I will continue to use Tolster Company uh, for other, you know, options or other, you know, uh, other things. And uh, I will do the same with Vetter. Vetter has been a very good company for me. Um, their uh, Cobra, you know, gun belt has been excellent. Uh, I do have a review on that if you want to check it out. Um... But like I said, the only reason why I went with better is because they have different patterns, different colors, different, you know, and their gun list to order a holster for is, is endless, when, especially when it comes to the HK firearms, which I'm a big fan of. Now, I'm going to give you a quick look of the gun, how it looks in the holster. Here's the complete package, as you can see. It just gives it a that elegant, classy look. Very clean, you know, very well put together. Let me... Um, Vetter, you know, has different options where you can get the, uh, you know, get the holster specially made for a light or a, uh, optics cut, which, um, I don't have any optics on my firearms, uh, so that cut for me is not necessary, but they do offer that option as well. Um, and like I said, it's a great company. They have all different types of holster patterns. They have different colors. They have a whole list of, of, of guns that they can make holsters for. They have uh, gun belts. They have leather gun belts as well. Dressy gun belts. 
Um, they have t-shirts, they have gun mats. Um, they have a list of, of stuff that you can, uh, you know, you can find on there. I'm pretty sure you will find something that you would like if you are decide to check them out. Or if you're just getting into guns and are a new gun owner and you're just looking for different options on a holsters company. Um, or maybe you're a left-hand uh, shooter that is looking for companies that make left-handed holsters. Now, they're a little bit more expensive than a right-handed holsters, depending on the patterns that you shoot. But, um, it's for me, it has been money well spent. Um, like I said, Tolster is a great company. I have no problems with them at all. I will be using some of their products down the line. Um, like I said, I am very interested in using one of their jump, dump trays. So, you know, it's just different options out there for a lot of people um but i will continue to use you know both companies because they have been uh, very well for me and once a company does good their products hold up i will continue to do business with them so this is just something that um that i wanted to bring you as a different uh, outlook you know different option for holsters and I just wanted to, you know, give you an overlook of the holster. And like I said, I have been wearing a new belt and I will do a review on that eventually uh, after some days. I've been wearing them for a while, but, um, you know, when I'm ready to give you a video on it, I will let you guys know what I think of the belt that I've been wearing. Um... You know, I'm the type of person that likes to try out products first, you know, for a while before I make an assessment on them uh, to see if they worth the money, they worth the quality. If they work, if they don't work, I want to make sure to be able to bring you guys accurate, you know, information so you guys can make a accurate choice on what you're looking for. And like I said, um... I decided to bring you this as an option um, because, you know, maybe some people like um, their left-handed shooters as well and they want to have, uh, you know, a different option in companies that make, you know, left-handed side holsters. And Tolster is a great company, but Vetters is also a great company and I just wanted to bring you guys uh, a different option, a different look, a different style. Um, like I said, check them out. They have a, a, an assortment of, you know, patterns that you can choose for your holster. They have a, a, a whole list of host, uh, firearms that they can make holsters for. Uh, so check them out. I'm pretty sure you will find something that you will enjoy. And I will get back with you guys soon. Uh, other than that, stay safe, stay aware, and stay loaded, guys.